Hmm. Hello, Acolytes, and welcome back to the Order Lutus. I'm Inquisitor Stern, and we are continuing our playthrough of Mount and Blade Warband. When we left off, the Vagirs had taken Wurcheg, and this was an opportunity to get a major city of our own to set up for future conquest. But first, we have to actually take it. And then we have to convince the king to give it to us. But we're going to try a solo siege, which is why we saved just before attempting this. So here we go. Besiege the town. God, we can get that ready in five hours. All right, let's go. Go boys. Got him. Got him. Getting up on the wall, getting up on the wall. taking losses but no real casualties yet no enemies have arrived all right we've already pushed them to their second wave I'm gonna go deal with these guys buddy. Did you drop some arrows for me? Well, I'm not done with these arrows yet. Alright. Let's go cause him some trouble. Oh, that is beautiful. Taking out all those archers in the back. We are starting to take casualties. Is there a guy down here? Thought I saw somebody down there. Here comes our next wave. Hey! How's it going, Jake? Streaming daddy. There we go. Now I can see chat better. Sorry. Chat was off to the side. I uh, switched which version of OBS I was using, so I'm still getting used to the setup. But yeah, I understand. You hit me with a hey baby and I didn't respond. That's awful. Gotta treat my boo better than that. Ah, oh, come on. Despawning all of the arrows. Well. Looks like we're getting in the melee! As the next wave of boys shows up. 
Yeah, that's what I switched to. I switched to Streamlabs. I was just using the base OBS. No bells or whistles. That dude threw an axe at me. Hey, DCG! Welcome to the stream. All right, and we have taken the wall. So I'm gonna shift things around just a little bit. There we go. You can see more of the chat and more of my screen because I was cutting off the left side. There we go. All right, fight in the streets. Ah, I understand. Don't ignore me. Come here, punk. <laughs> Streaming Daddy Dinner can be another name for lunch. I'm pretty sure. And then it would be supper is what we would think of as dinner. The English language is fun. And then there's that. UK is a different time zone. All right. Time to take the castle. Let's do this. Woo, that's a lot of throwing spears. <laughs> All one time zone. Earth. Alright, the rest of my boys got taken out. Alright, thanks. He shoots faster than me. But he doesn't stab better than me. Boom. Just wrecked. Alright, who do we keep? Wow. I think we took... Four casualties? Or maybe... Oh, right. We were fully maxed out. So we took... No, we weren't maxed out. Wow. We did not take that many casualties for taking out an entire city by ourselves. Alright. Who do we keep? Well, we keep a couple of uh, Mamluks, for sure. Get some master archers to put in the city. I 
as well. Looks like they've got bows as well. Lancer's probably high tier, so we'll keep you. Don't care about them. Some extra cheapies. Alright. Done. Whoa! <laughs> All the loot. Well, we'll take the stuff that's actually worth something. Actually, most of this is not bad value. Okay. This stuff is Garbo. Okay. Uh, well, we'll take it since we got room, and we're immediately going to sell it. Request this place. Okay. Put 20 of you in here. All these that I'm not worried about. Done. Okay. Market. Get rid of this stuff. Give me your money. And. Ooh, hey. Get rid of some of this that we don't need. Get rid of that bread. Grain. Got grain and bread. Yeah, boys, we're eating good tonight. Here we go. Fruits, veggies, cheese. Smoked fish. Yeah. And then we'll buy this salt while we're here. Okay. And we got a tournament. Let's do it. <laughs> I have freed your town. Now for a tournament. Who wants to fight? Oh no, they they have a salary. My, all of my troops actually cost a, a weekly allowance. And having better troops costs more money. And then you can improve morale by having a variety of food to consume. Good job, team. Let's see. Get that chat. Still adjusting things, getting it right. Okay, there. I can see all of chat now and all of this. All right, two teams of seven, big fight. Oh yeah, you also have to pay for uh, troops that are in garrisons like the castle, as well as the ones that are hanging out with you. My screen is frozen. Uh-oh. Well, let me finish this uh, fight and then I'll do something about that.
No? Screen's working here. Is it still frozen where you're at? Looks like it's skipping a lot of frames. All of a sudden. Huh. Hello. I would like you to stop doing that. Your stream is experiencing issues. Why, yes, I noticed. Huh. So we don't have many dropped frames, we just have skipped frames. That's an interesting problem. Looks like it's... Hmm... Doop 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 doop. I can't really change stream settings without ending stream. So hopefully it levels back out. Ah, there we go. Now it's starting to level back out. At least for a second. And the puppies are excited. Alright. We're just gonna power through. Hopefully this isn't an unwatchable mess later. Go team, go! Teams of two. No, oh, and we're starting right next to each other. And the final. I'm on a horse. Got him in one pass. That was easy. Woo! Alright. Anybody interesting in the tavern? Book merchant. What you got? <laughs> Nothing, because I have all the books. And I don't need the ransom broker. Okay. We are going to go grab some other troops. We are going to take... Ah, that might help. Go. as many of our marksmen as we can take with us back over here
put 30 of them in the city. Yeah. And then right back over here. Also, Bizarre, you leveled up. Hooray! Seems to have leveled out. We got plenty of house scarls. Yeah, we're gonna get the rest of those. Take these guys with us. So that they can start leveling up. Fantastic. Castle should be fine. Return to Wurchag in case the Vagir come to retaliate. Alright. And wait. Wait to hear if he's going to give this to me. Or if I'm going to lose the troops that I just put in there. But, even if he doesn't give this to me, he'll give me something good in exchange. So, still worth it. Oh. Group of enemies by my castle, huh? Yeah, medium-sized enemies? Alright. Yep, there's our weekly pay. Still making a profit. Oh, whoop. Wrong button. That's fine. Let's go take a gander at our castle. Looks like whoever was over here decided, nah, didn't want it. Yes! We have Wurchag. That is huge. Alright, manage garrison. be an acceptable fighting force. Get that operational. And the populace is cooperative to me. So now, let's see if there's a quest we can take that's reasonable. That's some distance. Uh, no. If we were in peace times, I would absolutely take that quest. But while we're actively at war with the Vagir, I don't wanna I don't wanna push my luck. Yep, alright. Manage garrison. Take my cavalry out. Honestly, we're going to transport 
50? Yeah, 50 is enough to hold this place. Put some more in Warchag. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. I could absolutely do it, but I'm worried that while I'm way to the south that some army's gonna try and take Wurchegg from me. Because this is not the army I want defending Wurchegg. This is solid. This is solid enough to keep any small band of nobility away, but an actual concerted effort would be hard to fight. I need this to be like a hundred house carls and I don't know like a few hundred like two or three hundred archers at least a hundred maybe maybe two hundred and three hundred and then this castle would be able to hold its own without me the player character is actually really powerful in this game like the difference of me actually being on the battlefield is huge Yup. Take you. Oh, don't loot everywhere. I want to be able to recruit people. Nobody likes me here. That's fine. Oh, but I can go recruit from these because we're not at war with Swadia. And since Swadia owns this area, hey guys. Welcome to the party. That is fantastic. Also, hey Kara. How's it going? have any iron for me? You do. And you will buy salt at a reasonable price. Ooh, give me that sausage. And you can have this grain. I'll take that meat. There we go. And all of your iron. Ooh, and some cheap tools. Yes, please. There we go. That is fine. And... More recruits. Ooh. Better than normal recruits. I'll take it. Oh, right, because this town, I've rescued this town multiple times, so they like me. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, I forgot that I lost Reezy because they took this castle. To make him a sad. Oh, wow. Curran Castle fell? Sargoth is surrounded, that is. The Nords are hurting. Oh, yeah, there's another problem. Escorting that caravan to an enemy enemy town? Yeah, no, they wouldn't have let me in. They would not be pleased by that. Alright, how we doing on recruits? That's fine. Yeah... Let's go see how Fanata likes me. <laughs> run away, run away, run away. He, like, immediately ran back to that castle. He is scared of me. He didn't want any. Aw, no recruits available. Yeah, what are you guys doing? Oh, you have small parties. Wow, being raided, of course. Hey, Reezy. You got recruits, don't you? If you said, uh, actually, I can try and disguise myself and sneak in, but, uh, yeah. Not optimal. Alright, let's hang out up here. Because, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we might go to war with Swadia. We're definitely at war with Vagir. Oh, and we're at war with the Kurji. 
Oh, the Vagir and the Kurjeet at the same time. That's why the kingdom is having such trouble. We're fighting a war on multiple fronts. Because the Kurjeet are here. Oh, but we took... We took Nara from them. Wow. Well, that's why the Kurjeet don't like us. We just took one of their main cities. So yeah, purple and uh, gray are both at war with us. Oh, we got... No, we do have... I didn't think we'd lost here. I don't know why my brain did that. Actually, why didn't I stop by Tyr? They might have resources I want. Aw, uh, they're fighting my little town in the south. Jerks. I'm way too far away to save it. Ooh, tools sell for a lot here. That's good to know. Get some more cheese and some more fruit and some more fish. Excellent. Keep the boys happy. Well, since we have salt, let's stop by Sargoth. Yup. Oh. Sargoth can't afford all of my stuff. And now we go north to Wurcheg. Ooh, now the Vagir are fighting two, two wars. Yeah, and there's enemies next to my castle. And we're upgrading. still up here? <laughs> you won't fight? Uh, let's go fight some sea raiders. <laughs> Attacking my city in the south again. They must have been chased away by an ally. That's funny. I don't need those kinds of sea raiders. There's a good number of sea raiders. This is all sad. I saw some up here. Maybe. Eighteen forty-five. That's what we're after. First, more upgrades. Fantastic. Get him. That's a nice head you have on your shoulders. Your face. Look at this cavalry charge. In the game of rock, paper, scissors, cavalry beats infantry. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Oh, that guy got a lance to the back of the head. Oof. Hey, they got reinforcements. My heavily armored horse and I will just walk into them. Hello. Hello. 
Oh, now they're running. That's a bad plan. Yup, taken care of. Woo, 13 prisoners. Yeah. Ooh. Boya. Uh. Boya yeah, Talbar must have formerly been a Rodok, because he's got way too many Rodok troops over here to be a Vagar. Five sergeants. Wow. I could absolutely destroy him, but I'm not really in that right now. Eleven of them. They're fine. Wait, being raided? Hold up. Hold up. Aw, uh, who just looted a friendly town? Who did it? Where are you at? Oh. Ho. Oh. Oh. What army... That is a lot of troops. 40 veteran spearmen, 5 sergeants, 1 sharpshooter, and a bunch of trained crossbowmen. Okay, we're going to say before doing this, our 115 really heavily trained guys versus 408 less trained, but oh boy, the number's there. And he, he wants to fight. He's coming to me. Yeah, we're going to save that one. And uh, let's do it. Big fight. Halt! They say you have defeated so-and-so. Yeah, uh-huh. But I will be a truer test of your skill at arms. Okay. Alright. Let's do it. No, we are not going to charge them directly. What do we got? So we're at a disadvantage, so we didn't get to deploy all of our troops. Uh, he's just coming straight for us. Shoot. Archers hang here. Uh, cavalry, get this idiot who just charged us. He got archered off. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Archers. You're going to hang out there. Good. Infantry. Hold the line in front of them. What few of you there are. Cavalry, charge. Look at this mismatch. I don't know why I saved. Look at this undisciplined mob coming at me. Listen, guys. 408 to 115 is a scary differential there. In this game. But, uh... Look at the... What is that? A peasant? What are you? Oh, no. You're wearing leathers. You have leather armor. Okay. Uh, is it super pixely? Hold on. Oh no, that's the game. That's the game. It is an older game. And I am also recording on 20 frames per second, so it's not like you're getting a high-end recording going on here.
Oh, one of our characters got knocked out. I am completely unfazed by this. Look at this mob over here. <laughs> he just killed one. Rolf leveled up. Okay. Uh, archers. We can move up the battle line, so archers. Here, infantry. Here. Cavalry keep tearing through them. Oh, we finally took a casualty. One of our heavy cavalry went down. See that guy turn around like he was like, uh, maybe I don't. Maybe I get out of here. Who's <laughs> I'm gonna let them kill you. You're dumb. There we go. Is anybody left? Oh, reinforcements. There they are. Yeah, I don't know when this game came out, like, off the top of my head. I want to say early 2000s. But then again... No, it's not that old. It's probably... In the, after 2010. But I couldn't tell you for certain. Now, the original Mountain Blade, I think, is a bit older. You I like our boy sneaking up on him. Hey, you got a nice crossbow there. It'd be a pity if I stepped... That dude has an arrow in the side of his head. Oh, and he was still fighting. What a trooper. I almost feel bad for cutting him down. Alright, we have suffered three casualties and three wounded, and he lost 90. 67 casualties and 23. So we lost six, he lost 90. We're not done yet. Everybody follow me? Ooh. Hills, huh? Yeah, I kind of want to move forward and take this middle hill. Get shield out. Just in case he meets me up here. I don't want to walk into a whole bunch of crossbows. That would be dumb. Yep, there he is. Alright. Archers here. Infantry here. Cavalry charge. Oh, no, no. Cavalry charge. Thank you. Man, that is a lot of crossbowmen. You put that little spear thing away. I don't appreciate that. Stabbing my horse. Oh, he turned around at the last second. Got him. Alright. Cool. Front line is doing fine. Let's move infantry here. Archers. 
up there. Hi, buddy. Good for you. Oh, I got an achievement. Caldarian Swiss Army Knife? Is that what it is? Or Caldarian Army Knife? That's funny. Alright. Looks like they're spawning down here. Alright. Archers. Infantry, you can go ahead and just charge at this point. We've pushed them back to their spawn. Get in this. Yeah, there's their spawn. Right there. That guy actually blocked my sword. Good on him. Right, that guy is dead. I just love their slatted wooden shields. Like, for real? You, you brought those? You got an arrow on your back. Oh. He just kept running. He was like, maybe I can make it. Nope. Oh, that guy did. He escaped. Routed enemy. Did we win? Yeah, we won. Cool. Thank you, Jake. I would appreciate that. All right. Four wounded. No casualties. This time we took out... 61 killed, 12 wounded, 1 routed. Ooh. Alright, he's down to 248. We're still at 108. We've lost 7 troops off the battlefield. And most of those are wounded. He's almost at half strength. Here we go. Round 3. The fact that we're still using our main cavalry charge. That's insane. Oh yeah, there they are. Ooh, look at them! They're actually doing battle lines! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Archers are in position. All right, get them. Blech. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to re-optimize now that I'm using Streamlab. So if you're watching this on YouTube and this episode seems extra... extra sad. I switched uh, streaming studio equipment and now we're, we're working on the bugs. Computer's holding steady, so it's not the computer. It's definitely the internet and or just the optimization.
All right, no casualties. He lost 53 and 14 wounded. At this point, he's lost all his elite troops. I'm not even going to be strategic. Get him. Actually, we'll probably do today's in two parts. We'll stop this at an hour, which is in only a few minutes. So after this big battle's done, we'll finish this up in part one and see if we can't solve some of our streaming problems before I pull it back up. Streaming woes. We are solidly winning this fight. They are now down to people using uh, pitchforks. done. We have one wounded. And they lost another 67. <laughs> We're at 105. They're at 111. Let's keep it up. Hopefully that means two more charges and we'll be done with this. They couldn't even give that lad a shield. We really are just down to killing their peasants that they gave sharp sticks to. I guess those are proper spears, some of them. That wave didn't take very long. No casualties. They're down to 48. All right, last charge. This should be it.
Well, and their final wave, they're actually intelligent. They're holding an archer line at the top of a hill. As far as last stands go, I've seen worse. Not all of them have shields. In fact, most of them don't have shields. Some of them are using clubs instead of swords. Oh. They're now throwing their archer line into melee because it's the only thing they've got left. This is no longer a battle. This is just a slaughter. There we go. Oh, and the noble ran away. Alright. That fight is done. Do our quick level ups.